I love LFCS because um, Cody had his adoption here and um, it brought me all together with my family. My name is Shane. I'm Emily and these are our two children. I'm Gavin. And this is Jaden who we adopted just shy of a year ago. We're Dave and Kathy. And this is our daughter Adria and our son Cody. We did uh, two adoptions through LFCS. Our journey um, looking into adoption began um, shortly after we were married and just struggled with infertility. And so we looked into adoption um, at that point and just was overwhelmed. And so we kind of delayed the start of that and um, we surprisingly became pregnant with Gavin. And so um, we had him and shortly after that, we were back on the road to adoption again. We were overwhelmed like many couples starting the process and um, just like you said, we felt an instant connection with the social worker that we met with and um, there was a sliding scale which was beneficial for our family financially um, and just the overall connection that we had and the services that they provided as a whole, not just our family but also to the birth family. When LFCS counsels a birth family or a birth mother, um, they definitely take into consideration what that birth mother or birth family wants, whether it's going through the adoption process, whether it's it's going through the pregnancy and keeping the child for themselves. Two things that made our adoption experience so great with Lutheran were the adoption workshop definitely was top for me, and then the, uh, the constant communication and them to, to stay in contact with us and uh, just encourage us through our small, short wait. During the process from start to finish, LFCS is with you the whole time um, in constant communication letting you know um, where, where you're at in the process, um, letting you know what the next steps are, um, helping, helping to walk you through the steps that need be. You're, you're definitely not on this alone. You are, or you're not in this alone. You are, LFCS is with you every step of the way. My biggest fear with the starting the adoption process was the openness, for sure. Uh, I think the adoption workshop definitely help that out just to be able to to listen to people's stories and, and how they're involved with the uh, the birth family or if it was the birth parents how they're involved with the birth family you got it from from each side it was great it was everything that we wanted it was more than we wanted so we left feeling completely at peace with that like this is definitely the right decision so Personally, I know a lot of families that we've talked to have been really nervous about the home study and a social worker coming to their home and just, do I have to clean with a toothbrush and do I have to have every, you know, crumb off the floor, those kinds of things. And that wasn't so stressful for us. I think having friends have gone before us and just being able to share, like, it's no big deal. You know, they're everyday people just like us and they're just doing what they need to do and know to ensure the adoption can take place. It, it seems so simple, but it meant so much. Um, when I had reached out to Lutheran family, we were given our social worker's name by a friend who had used them for their home study. And she said, we loved her, you will love her. And um, I called, and after leaving messages at several other agencies over the course of months and years, um, this social worker picked up the phone and literally answered on the other end and said, hi. And I was like, that's it? Like, she answered her phone. You know, I, I didn't leave a message. and. It was a 30-minute conversation of answering specific questions I had and then even going further, inviting our family to come the next week to meet in person and to answer those things even more in depth, I think was, just for me, what I was looking for. I wanted that personal touch. For families who are starting, or thinking about starting this process and feel overwhelmed, um, I'm not going to say it's not <laughs> overwhelming, um, but it's, it's well worth the process is well worth the end result. Um, just once you get started and just know what's going to happen will help out tremendously. And in my heart I feel that I should give this child to you. And maybe you can tell your baby when you love him so that he's been loved before by someone who delivered your son from 
God's arms to my arms to yours I'm just trusting in my feelings and I'm trusting God above and I'm trusting you can give this baby both his mother's love and maybe you can tell your baby when you love him so that he's been loved before by someone who delivered your son from God's arms to my arms to